Hi and welcome to Bronislav and Denmark. Bronislav uh, Ungdomsskole is a public institution, which means that we get our funding from uh, taxes. Uh, we have an annual budget around 6 million Danish kroner. We spend the budget on uh, clubs and on teaching young people in their spare time different kinds of curricula that could be uh, from ski trip to Austria to uh, cultural things, painting, uh, language training, for instance uh, training in Spanish or Italian and German. The most important thing for us is that it's a win-win situation that both we gain and the volunteers gain something from this project. So we expect, we expect the volunteers to work in our clubs, in our three youth clubs. Um, in these clubs, there are age, the, the kids are aged between 9 and 13 years old. And the volunteers work there daily from Monday to Friday. And besides that, we um, expect our volunteers to do some projects during their stay that could be uh, making um, a recording projects, filming with our TV youth. This year the volunteers have done language courses, which is possible if the volunteers come from a, a country that could be interesting for us to do some language courses. Hi, I'm Timo. I'm from Germany and I'm 20 years old. I'm an EVS volunteer here in Bronnerslo Undomskole. And behind me you see the office, the administration and also the place where I'm working, the Bronnerslo Fritis Club. My name is Preza and I'm the club leader in Brønderslev. Uh, in Brønderslev you can make a lot of stuff because we have a big house here. You can be in our computer room and you can be in our career and make a lot of stuff with the kids. Uh, we have also a hall where you can play football or a lot of other stuff with your body. Hi, I am Luis from Spain and I am 28 years old. And hi, I'm Sara. I come from Italy and I'm 27 years old. And this year we are voluntary in Denmark with this project called AVS. And this is the British club Yellow Group where we work. So come with us. Hello, my name is Jan. I'm the club leader uh, of the club here in Yellow. And uh, the special thing about the club here is we got a, a house that is renovated recently. And um, we got a gym and we got uh, uh, music rooms and we got uh, drama lessons. The EVS uh, that are working here are almost doing the same stuff that we do. Uh, they work in the kitchen, they play with the kids and uh, if they want to, they can uh, make their own projects with the kids. I 
I'm Marianna, I'm from Italy. I'm in Denmark as a AVS and I'm working in Drone Club. Hi, I'm Pau and I'm the leader here in Drangeland. Um, I'm new here, just been here for about a month. Of course here the kids can uh, do a lot of different things. Play ball, you know, physical, physical activities. You, of course you can play computer and PlayStation and online games and uh, just hang out together. But I think uh, as a club we try to evolve uh, with the kids who come here. So it's not like you can do just these things we try to change all the time. If you are an EVS here, it's uh, not like you have a specific uh, roles or tasks you have to do. It uh, depends much about uh, the personality, who you are and uh, what are your interests. The role as a mentor is to make sure that the, everything about the volunteers is uh, okay, all the practical stuff, and uh, give them a helping hand, make sure that they uh, make their evaluation and youth passes, and yeah, have the private talks. Now you have seen the places where we are working as a volunteer, you have seen the persons you are working with, but being an EVS in Brønners Lundum School means also that you can participate in one or more of the activities that the school is offering for the young kids. Mm -hmm. 